Colleen here at DIY Behind Love and Thistle.com and today I'm excited to be joining Old World New Home in her $5 thrift store challenge. So although I haven't been to the thrift store recently, I have had this little thrift store package kicking around for a while now. I bought it a while back with intentions of making Christmas decorations, but then never did that. So when this challenge came around, I thought this is $5.99, it's close. I'm gonna see what I can make with them. Even though we're not having anybody over for Easter this year, I thought that it would be fun to put together a little spring tablescape using these mini little vintage pie tarts, tart pans, is that what we call them? Uh, just to make dinner a little bit more fun while we are at home here. So I have three different ideas we're gonna test out and see how they work. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, I would so love if you did that below so you don't miss out on any more DIY or home decor videos. All right, let's do it. Okay, so it was $5.99 for the whole bag of these. Um, I don't think I'm gonna use the whole bag of them. There's one of the smaller size here. And then the rest are this larger size. So I think I'll mostly work with the larger size just so that they're similar. The first super simple idea is to either put a tea light or a pillar candle in them to catch the wax. I feel like this is cute. Have those down the table. You could do the taller one as well. So I will do some tea lights down the table. Okay, so then other than tea lights, I thought that it would be fun to use some kind of as eggs nests for Easter, kind of put a couple eggs in one. And I was thinking of how I could maybe put something in the bottom to look like an Easter egg nest. So since we're working with what we've got at home, I've kind of picked some cutie little grasses and a little bit of just normal grass as well, just to make a little nest. Oh, and those are cute. And you could also like wrap it depending what kind of grass you have. Like this one here is really long. I'll put some curls in with that little guy. And then last but not least, I thought that these would make for really cute little place cards. So for that, I have this really pretty watercolor paper. It is from the Natalie Milan collection from Cricut. She has a bunch of beautiful watercolor papers, but I chose this one because it's really neutral, which will make it easy to letter on top of. cards I could letter names on them and then I also wanted to do this one so I was thinking it might be really cute since these come up you could wrap it around like this with like a little piece of grass underneath even for a couple it's cute
This one needs switch to a smaller pen. Okay, so there is my three or four, I guess, different ideas of how to use these for candles, for little birds egg nests or Easter egg nests, and then the two different kinds of place cards here. So I am gonna go ahead and I'm gonna set this table with these ideas for a little Easter dinner. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss out on any more DIY or home decor videos. And big thank you to Hillary from Old World New Home for hosting this $5 Goodwill challenge. As always, if you'd like to be notified about new videos, make sure to hit that bell. We'll see you guys next time. Now we're gonna sit here and eat our meal by ourselves. But the kids will be very excited about it, so.